Welcome one and all to my YouTube channel, Techno Babble. I am the Techno Babbler here with the Apothecary and the Witch Part 9. I recorded uh, an episode in between the last one and this one, and I just thought that it was not really worthy of a full episode, so I'm going to quickly show you a recap of what happened there. So Leliana, in her new witch's work area, we've got the easel and the stuff in there before. We've got this new chest, and I added some shelves here. And you'll notice, oh, that is floating. Well, we'll take care of that. Ooh, it's mysterious. How is it floating? <laughs> I added this here, so I wanted to play with that as well because I've never, ever used that item, and it seemed very almost magical or mystical. And the other thing I want to do, because I never play with them, is I want to create a club. So let's do that right now. I had this great idea after watching someone else's LP. But we're going to create a club, and we're going to call it the Top Hat Society. And will it be an open invitation? No, we'll do an invite only. We will have, let's invite another sim. And for right now, we will just invite Gilbert Clay. Is there anyone? No, we'll just do Gilbert Clay for now. And what are some things that we're going to do? Okay, so I have chosen for the Top Hat Society so far that they will do woodworking, they will do excavating, they will like to read, they will like to play instruments, and they will use vampiric powers. Let's choose a logo for the Top Hat Society. This gemstone for now. He has fallen asleep in the bath. I want to try this too. I want to try summoning. Summon Advaith. It was a person that we didn't particularly care for. Uh, we'll have him come down here and we will brew an herbal remedy and we will do a sadness alleviation. Dart yard markup prices. Let's mark up the prices to 300% and see what happens. And then start yard sale. Oh my gosh! We sold the plate. That was 8,000 simoleons. Oh my gosh, we now have 34,000 simoleons. These townies will buy anything. <laughs> okay, so now you guys know why we have a little bit of extra money where we are. And now uh, let's dive into part nine, the full version. So let's dive right into the gameplay. All right, Gilbert is snoozing away in his bed and I think we will have this episode focus a little bit more on Gilbert I think Leliana is working on her archaeology skill over here she has uh yeah we will work from home she has done some painting and she's really not focused too much on her work is she read a gar uh what would that say read a gardening skill book all right well we can do that uh so she is learning all sorts of things about the witchcraft in this universe and how to harness the power. And one of the things I'm going to go ahead and do is she has enough points to get a trait. So we're going to come in here to the trait or the reward store, get a trait. And we've got a lot of, we've got 4,735 saved up. And I want to come down to our 4,000 range and I want to get hardly hungry. And I think if I do hardly hungry, I'm hoping that if I do hardly hungry, then she will not be have as much thirst. You know what? Actually, I'm going to save real quick. Okay, I just saved. So if I come down here and get the hardly hungry trait, then I'm hoping that she will want to have less thirst. So we're going to go ahead and purchase that, and we'll find out if that uh, does it or not. If not, I just saved, and we can always exit out. Let's come down to our needs. I know we just I just got done saying how this is going to be a gilbert focus episode, but he's still snoozing. So hopefully her thirst goes down a little bit less than everyone else uh and i really think i'm gonna have her focus a little bit more on the archaeology skill right now mainly because you see how many simoleons we got and i really want to build a new shop for them literally an apothecary uh and it will also be a club hangout for the top hat society so i'm pretty excited to get some more money so the more uh, skill she's got in archaeology you saw how fast we were able to raise up money it was super fast we sold like one item it was crazy expensive uh when we sold it as a garage sale the garage sales in the sims 4 are legit all right gilbert can we get up yet i guess we'll let you keep snoozing and then we'll get into some gameplay and i have him queued up to eat some elderberries because i would like him to get some more points too uh he needs to eat 10 plants, so when he gets up, he'll eat those 10 plants. 
Aw, sweet dreams, Gilbert. See you in the morning. A little bit later, that is. After careful analysis, Leliana has determined this artifact genuine. Further analysis will allow Leliana to continue to hone her archaeology skill. Uh, so that is an Amazonite skull. It's poor quality, but it is rare. So you know what? Since it's such a poor quality, it's kind of cool looking, though. We'll just put it over here for now. This is the kind of stuff that I think will be fun to, like, decorate the... Uh, Top Hat Society build once we buy... Well, first we're going to have to find a location. I think we have some more auth artifacts that we can authenticate. Yeah, we'll just have her go through and do some authentication on some artifacts. <gasps> Gilbert's up. He's eating his berries. One. Ah, ah, ah. Why did that only count as one berry? What the heck? He's like down in these berries and it's only counting it as one. Eat that berry. Nom, 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 nom. Did that count? That counted. One more berry. He's got so many berries. And since Leliana cannot yet go out and about in the sun, I am going to have Gilbert focus on a few other things. All right, he wants to cook two plates of beetles, but we're going to switch his aspiration for a minute. Uh, let's hop in here. You know, if you guys are long viewers of the channel, you know I love to hop around on the aspirations. I mean, really. I don't have one single aspiration as a person, so why would Sim have a single aspiration? So he wants to collect 10 collectibles, and I tell you what, there is no better place to do that than Oasis Springs. So we're going to have him freshen himself up, use the bathroom, uh, we will have him brush his teeth, and then we will go out on a hunt for some stuff while Leliana works on developing her archaeology skill and then possibly her gardening skill while we're away. And I also want to add some more members to our Top Hat Society. Let's see, if we come in here, I decided there were some great people. Let's see. Um, let's go in here and, oh, this is going to take forever to load. Okay, I'm not seeing the people I wanted to add to it yet. That's weird. I know that she knows them. Why does it not show them anywhere? Oh, well, we can add Ayana. That's for certain. Let's add her. Uh, but we will end the app, end the gathering. All right, Gilbert is almost ready to go out and about. He is not having too much fun, but I'm not too worried about that. Leliana is working on authenticating this artifact, which she might stop doing when we leave, and I'm not too worried about it. All right, he is ready to go out and about. So let's travel with Gilbert. All right, I don't know why there is a copy of Lucas Dark and the Increasingly Unlikely Series of Coincidences here in the uh, park, and it seems a little bit eerie, but we're going to go with it. Let's have... Uh, oh, we can't go over there. Let's have... Gilbert, check out the lay of this land. I'm hoping that we can come in and find some collectibles. And I think that I also really kind of want to get a dog for this family. So I might do that in this part as well. I know it's like a little bit too much, but I think it just seems delightfully appropriate that this family would have a dog and the dog could help with some of the hunting for different objects, and, you know, I really haven't explored the training of dogs, and I know, I know, this episode, or this LP is fastly becoming, like, everything that Technobabbler hasn't done in The Sims we're gonna do in this series, but that's not 100% true. Uh, heard there's a world-famous circus in the city, wanna go check it out? Yeah, we can go check it out later. Uh, let's see. Let's see what we can, I thought, oh, here we go, here we go. There are some collectibles. Gilbert found a minnow while he when he was digging stuff up he found a minnow I don't even understand but we'll go with it we will go look free hot dogs oh no we can resume but they're still kind of free I also really want to go in here so I have to get handiness level 10 so I think Gilbert will focus on handiness level as well oh my gosh you guys I swore there was like tons of things here to harvest and I'm not finding that many things. What's this? Some wild, ooh, a wild blackberry bush. We can definitely have him come over here and do some fishing with bait. And we will fish with, do we have anything that's good for fishing? Let's fish with an, a minnow. That makes sense. And then I can queue up some more items while we are searching for things. You guys are probably like seeing stuff that I'm not. And like, why? You're missing stuff. You're missing stuff, Techno. Uh, hopefully we are not missing too much. I also had the idea of, I'm contemplating having Gilbert join the science career. Uh, I would totally want to redo the whole science lab, though, and I'd want it to be a little bit more like alchemy. So, like, 
I want him to master the herbalism and then I want him to start studying like alchemy and I think that's what I would have the sort of the science career be so you guys leave me some notes in the comments below if you are interested in having him go down that path and I don't think I have any LPs where they are playing where he's playing in the science field I know I have personally played loads of scientists but I don't think uh I've done any LPs with that so let me know if you guys would find that interesting or unique or would enjoy it at all. But I thought there's some perks to having him uh, become or study alchemy a little bit too. All right, we're going to have him speed through some fishing. Oh, look at these guys just caught a huge fish over here. Who is this? Way to go, Kengo. I really thought there was way more items over here. All right, we're going to go ahead and speed through this part a little bit. I went ahead and brought Gilbert over to Pebble Burrow because I was wanting to have him fish, or I wanted to have him find some more items, and there was, like, nothing there. So he's going to do a little fishing while I zip around the world here. And I swear, every time I played in Oasis Springs, there's, like, way more things here. Maybe because it's winter? I don't know. Um... But if they had a dog, then, then we could send the dog out to go hunt for stuff for us. And I have the perfect dog of mine, and I'm going to download the dog from the gallery because I have watched an awesome simmer create a dog. And I think I'm going to go with a Doberman. And the simmer who has made it is called Pug's Own, and you should definitely check out her YouTube channel. It is amazing, and she makes the most detailed animals it's just it's absolutely fascinating uh to watch her work and she gives such great detail about the animals and the the history of the breeds it's just absolutely amazing so definitely check out pugs pug owned i think pugs owned it's either pug owned or pugs owned and i'll put a link to the her youtube channel down below but make sure you guys Check it out, and check her out on the gallery if you want an amazing, amazing-looking uh, animals. Also, I know that she also is taking requests, so if like you want her to make a particular dog breed for you, you can send in your requests, and she's got a pretty, like, probably large queue of people requesting things, but she is working her way through her list to make different uh, dog breeds. All right, I'm going to go ahead and speed through this part where Gilbert is going to stop fishing for a minute, and go get some collectibles. Okay, we have harvested, I believe, all of the resources we could here from this world. So let's hop in um, our, guess our hot air balloon and let's travel to the next location. Doesn't it seem like Gilbert would totally travel like via hot air balloon or like a blimp? Something like that. All right, let's travel to the next location. All right, Gilbert is at a new location. We'll start him off by doing a little bit of fishing while I scour around for some collectibles. I tell you, I know that in other gameplay, I have found collectibles way faster in Oasis Springs than this. I can't, I feel like I'm failing you guys. I'm so sorry. I don't know why I can't find any, like you think this place would be riddled with fossils and gemstones and that kind of thing. I don't even see anything on these, this lot. But I know that I've played in worlds before where, or in Oasis Springs where there's more things. In the meantime, he is working on his, uh, what is this? This is the Angling Ace reward. Oh, he wants to look for a frog. That's going to be a place where he can go check for a frog. I just swore there was more things here. Uh, let's see, what is he wanting to do? He's wanting to fish in at least three locations. I'm going to go ahead and speed through this part, you guys, and then... We might have him go home, and maybe we can find... Uh, yeah, I changed my mind. Uh, we might be able to have him find some stuff back at home, because I know he also needs to, like, shower and stuff, because his... Oh, and he's getting hungry, and his hygiene's going down, so we need to take care of some of his needs. I'll have him go ahead and grab those frogs real quick, and then we will head home. All right, you guys, Gilbert is grabbing these frogs, and then we are going to... Wait, 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 wait. We need to switch this real quick, because <laughs> all of a sudden, I'll be in the wrong category, and he won't get... Oh, we already have three, three frogs. Oh, well. Uh, we have found no fossils, though. That's ridiculous. All right, let's travel home. All right, Gilbert just got home. There is his lovely wa wife watching TV. I think he's going to come in here, and he is going to... 
Oh, wait, we're selected on Leliana. We're going to have him come in here, and I think he would just, you know, come in here and talk about her, talk about his day out and about, um, maybe give a heartfelt compliment, tell her about how wonderful she is, and then let's give her, I think a friendly, I'd like to give her some gifts. Let's give her some friendly gifts of some things that we found while we were out and about. Now, this is not something that I'm imagining she's going to think is so amazing or anything like that, but... I think that she might like a few of these things, like... Ooh, look at that fish. Pretty. The sick... Is that is that a chicklid? No, cichlid? I think it's cichlid. Uh, let's give her a dirt frog. <laughs> Such a weird gift. But, you know, she would like it, I think. I think after that, we're going to have him... He, he started making some dinner, so we will have him... Oh, my gosh. Seriously, Gilbert? Going to go up, going to go down. You You pick. We're going to have you come up here and resume the spaghetti, and hopefully you don't burn the house down. Meanwhile, Leliana is feeling a little thirsty, and let's have her go ahead and have some plasma packs. We'll drink a few of these, and then maybe we can bring this, breed this frog with the striped eggplant frog. And I wanted to see, did she finish her archaeology thing? No, she did not yet finish it. So let's have her come down here and authenticate that artifact uh, I think that they will also maybe discuss the idea of getting a dog. I think she's all for it. She loves animals. And you know what? Here's a frog for you. And she goes, I was just thinking, what if we get a dog, Gilbert? Gilbert is all about the idea about getting a dog. So I think we'll do that toward the end of this episode. We will get a dog. I love that idea. I'm super excited to add another character to this uh to this world too and i love our sims or six and mosquito trap we need to can we fertilize it how's her like sell it oh we have seeds that we could sell what else could we do let's uh i think we would actually harvest it and then maybe let's um can we fertilize or anything oh that's the other thing that'll be good to have is that then she can uh oh look our flowers bloomed then she can use the dogs um well the dog's poop for fertilizer because apparently it's really good fertilizer. Uh, then we can have her come in here and we can harvest the bluebells and harvest the chrysanthemum and harvest the daisies. Did we finish this? How much is this worth? Uh, can we make it pristine? Let's see, let's see, let's see. Scent with craft and arrangement. Of, oh, it was not excellent quality. So we'll just go ahead and sell that, I guess. Let me check in on Gilbert. He's going to make himself some breakfast. I mean, dinner. Ooh, 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 ooh. That looks like it's so spoiled. Is it because it like set out? Is that even a thing? I did not know that was even a thing. Let's have him because I don't want him to. No, no, no. Is it bad? How do I can tell? Let's see. Oh, no, it's good. You can eat a serving. Sorry, Gilbert. My bad. I said you couldn't, but you can. You could. Ew. We need a maid or something. Uh, she is working on authenticating this. Hopefully we can authenticate a few more items and then we can maybe sell some of them at our garage sale place i think that we will round this episode out i'm going to attempt to go into the create a sim space and create or download the dog that i want to get from the gallery before that i guess i need to cue him up to come in here and take a shower and then i am going to let her finish authenticating this before we go into create a sim so i will have her finish this up and then we'll go into create a sim all right, Leliana has discovered that this terracotta, that this is an excellent quality terracotta setit. All right, let's, I'm going to botch it. Set litziti statue. So we will definitely put that in her inventory and then have her come over here and sell it because that would be awesome to, we probably make a pretty penny off of that guy. 485 so we'll put it in there for now i'd like to get a few more items made before we go starting a shop sell though so like i said i'm gonna go into full edit mode let's see how do i do that um modifying cast all right so we are going to add a sim and we are going to how do we do that do we go up here let's see save hassle open gallery let's see if we can find pugs owned in the gallery all right, it is pug owned. Sorry, pug owned. If I was, I was totally botching earlier and saying pugs owned, but you know, couldn't remember. So let's go to pug owns library or gallery and let's grab the 
Look at these dogs. Aren't they amazing? Look, she redid the fox. They are just absolutely amazing. So we are going to grab the Doberman Pincher, I believe. And the only thing I might do is I know that she talked about the tail being important and the ears being important to leave that way, but I might want to change the look up a little bit. So I'm going to place in the household, and then we will see about doing some light editing. All right, after quickly doing a quick view of the Doberman and its breed, I know I really want to... Let me just see what the ears look like up. Let me just see what they look like when they are up. Uh, do I like it better? Oh, it does look pretty cool. Oops, I don't want those. I want those long ones. All right, I think I want to have them up because I just I really like them. How do we come out of the ears? Sorry, I don't do a lot of editing with the animals. Uh, let's see what a short tail looks like. Oh, man. I actually kind of like the long tail on him. I think I'm going to keep it. Do I want to keep his ears up? Let's undo. Oh, I can't change him. He's so cute. All right, we are going to name this dog. So we are going to name, give him the same last name, Clay. And as cheesy as this sounds, I just think that this dog should name, be named Cerberus. Cerberus Clay. I guess I should make sure that I can say it before I go naming him Cerberus. Cerberus. Maybe we should call him Severus, because <laughs> that's what I keep going back to. All right, we're going to go with Severus, because I can't say things right. Uh, Severus. Severus Clay. I like it. This will be Severus Clay, and he will be the newest member of the family. He's loyal, he is smart, and he is active. Let's change the active to, I want to have him be a hunter. I know that he's not a hunter, but I want him to be a hunter. But I do think he would be very loyal, and I do think he'd be very smart. So that is the newest addition to the Clay family. Let's go ahead and have them meet the family and we will wrap this episode up. I hope you guys are enjoying the series so far. Here is our newest member, Severus Clay. Aw, I love him. He's adorable. Gilbert, you are going to get take your shower. Uh, let's call him on over so that Leliana can meet him. I think he is adorable and I can't wait to get him trained up to help us with all of our family things. Let's see. Uh, you know what? We will cancel all these things. We can do these things in a minute. You should meet Severus, and we will pet him, and we should talk to, and we will offer. Well, let's get to know him. Yeah, let's see what we can learn about our little puppy. And, of course, we're going to pet him again. Uh, I will do some off-camera work where we get him all of the things he needs, and I'll find a nice spot for them in the house. After Gilbert gets his shower done, we'll have him come and use the toilet and then he can come meet his dog Severus. Oh, what's the matter, puppy? Oh, I should have made him a puppy. No, I don't think I can handle a puppy right now. Uh, let's see. More choices. Friendly. We can praise him and we shall maybe give him a little brush. Give him a treat. Oh, he's so handsome. I love it. I wonder if you can train him to attack people. I totally could see him learning to attack people. I did like his ears up, but he's just so cute like that. I'm going to go ahead and queue up her. She was harvesting everything. We'll have her come in here and harvest, and then we'll have her sell this. And then she was getting thirsty again. Can we come in here and, you know what, maybe we could. No, she's drained her husband a lot. Can we summon that person and drain them? That would be awesome. Let's uh, try summoning Advaith because I've not seen that happen. Just a little bit of witchcraft in this episode I think would be appropriate, right? Then after that, Gilbert, how are your needs? He's sleepy. Wake up, Gilbert. I'm going to have him come and practice making bar drinks for a minute because I think he would be good at making drinks. Look at the little mosquito eater. It's eating them. I love it. Put the wallet real quick. Okay, you know what? Before he goes and makes a drink, we're going to have him call the dog inside so Gilbert can meet his new buddy, Severus. She's going to go ahead and harvest those things. And then I want to see, I really want to see how this works. All right, shh, so where is the dog? There he is. Oh, what a good pup. Uh, let's pet him and let's talk to and let's... Uh, let's get to know a little bit, and let's pet him again, and we should definitely offer friendship, and then pet, and I really want to see how, oh, is she going to literally go around harvesting everything? What is she harvesting, Bluebell? Oh, all right, well, that's not bad. Look at that, I love it. She's good at harvesting stuff. What are these guys? 
Were those bluebells? Oh, those are wolfsbane. I don't think he even has a need. She has a need for those. All right. How does this work? When we summon someone, do they just show up? Where's Advaith? We need Advaith. That's not Advaith. Oh, it totally is Advaith. <laughs> I guess I guess it shows what I know. All right. I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this part right here, you guys. We have our new puppy, and I'm going to have Gilbert train up with him a little bit more and these two guys are going to be best buds be sure to leave me some notes in the comments let me know if you're interested in gilbert possibly learning taking on the science career uh i would need to do a complete renovation of that place because i'd want it to not so much be a scientist as i would want it to be an alchemy uh location or an, i would want him to study to become an alchemist but i think before i have him do that i really want him to master the herbalism so until next time you guys tomalagi